Woo, that was a great workout. Ah, oh, time for some post-workout meals going on here. Mm. Oh, nothing beats a good taco after a good workout. Mm. Some good stuff here. Shit. This wasn't supposed to be recording. You guys weren't supposed to see that I'm that I'm eating tacos. But but trust me, there's there's a good reason that I'm that I'm eating these tacos. I just just hear me out here. I had a, I had a I promise. It, it's a really good reason. Uh, uh, today. I posted on Facebook and Instagram that I wanted to get a 250 pound bench press. Fucking tacos. I don't know why I got tacos, you guys. I promise you, I'm still the same old body by burgers. But I wanted to get that 250 pound bench press. You guys have no idea how bad I wanted to get this 250 pound bench press. I have been hung up on getting anything anywhere close to 250 pounds for about two and a half months. And anybody that's, that's into fitness and they want to get that new rep, that new max, they know how tough and frustrating it can be to get that new, that new max. So why am I eating tacos instead of burgers? Well, simply put, I fucking crushed it! I fucking crushed 250 pound bench press. And it felt so goddamn good. So good! So instead of burgers, I'm treating myself to damn tacos, okay? I'm still the same old body by burgers, and you're still gonna see me eat some burgers, but I wanna reward myself with something just a little bit different. And it's goddamn Taco Tuesday, so I went for it. I got 250 pounds for two reps today. And I could not be happier. With that being said, you guys, I'm going to tell you what I want laid out for myself when it comes to strength in the next six months. So, I've already been able to do a 315 pound squat, but it was ugly. It was ugly as all hell. So, my goal in the next six months is to get to a 350 pound squat. So we're looking at about a 35 pound increase uh, for two reps, but it's gonna be nice and smooth. It's not gonna be ugly and jittery and horrible like it was last time. When it comes to deadlift, I've used a trap bar the, or the hex bar, so to speak, before, and I've gotten 365 pounds, but that was with head wraps. I know my straight bar deadlift is not nearly as strong and I have a problem with grip strength. My best that I've gotten on deadlift with a straight bar, no wraps, so far, is right around 265. I want to get that over 306 months from now. Bench press, like I said today, fucking crushed that 250 pounds and I could not be happier. Um, so I want to add at least, I'm going to try and add 20 pounds to that bench press in six months. And for those of you that have been struggling and, and going on for weight training and lifting, trying to add strength, you know as a natural person or as anybody that is trying to add to those totals, it can be goddamn hard. It can be frustrating and it can be the ultimate piss off in the end. So just stick with it, guys. Uh, just keep doing what you're doing and you will get there. I have a lot of tacos here. I'm gonna enjoy every last one of them because this is a reward to myself. Um, two and a half months isn't even that long to be frustrated with a lift. A lot of people go six months without with, with trying to get the lift. So I'm happy. I hit it relatively quickly. It went up nice and smooth. So that's what I'm happy with. So really, uh, in the next six months, do you guys have my goals there? I'll put them in the comment section just to make sure that you guys have them tangibly. Uh, 
man, it just feels really good to hit that bench press mark. Still doing lots of conditioning as well, uh, as you can see by my Facebook and Instagram posts. Uh, follow me on Facebook, it's simply just Body by Burgers on Facebook. On Instagram, it's body underscore by burgers because some ass had already taken body by burgers. Uh, today's a good day, guys. Just remember, never give up on those fitness goals. It's a long process. I've been doing it now for four months. Am I anywhere where I thought I was going to be? Probably not on the weight loss end of it, but I've also mixed up a ton of training, had a ton of cheap meals, but um, it's a sustainable transformation that I'm making. That is today's video, guys. Make sure you like the video. If you love the channel, make sure you can subscribe to it. We're going to put it right there this time. Um, and I'm going to have constant content for you guys. Make sure you stay motivated. Until next time, guys, burger power.